Welcome back to another hip hop breakdown. Let's get right into it. Here we go. All right, that is what we had. Okay, so uh, first of all, this is Karin, Kieran, Karin, <laughs> uh, out of um, Cabrillo College, and uh, behind the camera is Maria, so thank you both for helping out with this video. Okay, here we go, let's get right into it. Uh, we got, this is more of a, a like a popping routine, however, we're not popping, all right? So this, this is a lot of isolation. Let's get right into it. Here we go. Let's break it down slow. One, two, three, four, and four. Okay, so we did this slow, okay? Let's break that down. Uh, I'm stepping on the one, coming back on the two. One, two, three, and. So notice on the three and. Um, on the three end, take a look at the feet. The feet, both feet, the angle of the feet, they're pointing outward, uh, about 45 degrees each side, okay? And then right on the four, boom, I'm collapsing in. So the heel, I'm, I'm pivoting. See, I'm pivoting on the ball of the feet here. So the heel goes out, all right? So now, basically, my toes are actually pointing straight forward. Actually, uh, take a look. Corinne has a really, really nice turn in. She's turning in. But if you're more flexible, you can do that, right? I'm not as flexible as her, but, but the idea is the knees are collapsing in. Rewind that real quick. So before I start, <clears throat> my, my knees are, or my toes are pointing out, just like Corinne's as well. However, though, she had her uh, knees bent already. What I like for her to do is on the, on the three end, three end, on the end, see, legs are straight. So I want to be high. I want to be tall. Three and right on the four, then I collapse down. All right. So that's the thing to watch out for. Let's take a look at that tempo. One, two, three, and four. Okay. So great job. That's it. Okay. Now moving forward to the next part. Slow. Five, six, seven, eight. All right. So five, six, seven. Eight. Let's take a look at that one more time. On the five. So I'm stepping in. Rewind that real quick. Five. So this is actually my left leg. Left leg is gonna step in. Left or left foot is gonna step into the right, and I'm gonna lean. Okay. So my hip is going side to side at the same time as going side to side. Corinne's is a good job right here. Uh, the upper body is is going the opposite opposite way. Five, six, and what I'm doing is I'm kind of. I'm bringing my shoulder, or I'm bringing my elbow up, okay? Six, seven, seven right there, and then lean on the eight, okay? Five, six, seven, eight. Let's take a look at that slow. Five, six, seven, eight. Let's, uh, one more thing I wanna mention. So on the seven, five, six, right on the seven, you see how like, actually before, even before the seven, take a look. Five, six, right on the six. My hip is my hip is on my left side. Thus, my weight is on the left side. Okay. Now I'm able to lift up my right leg. Take a look at my right leg. This foot, right, right here. It's already off the ground, right? So that means my weight is on this side. And as I shift my weight over, it's gonna step at the same time. Okay. So that's the, that's the key. I think uh, in class I see a lot of people aren't able to get their feet off because. Maybe their weight is on the wrong leg. Okay, that's seven, and then I lean forward on the eight. Okay, so let's take a look at that tempo. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, that's five, six, seven, eight. All right, so let's put it together from the one. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, so I, I was just noticing that uh, Karen didn't step on that five. One, two, three, and four. Five. See, right on the five, sometimes uh, we forget to step and we just start leaning. So she actually forgot to step on the five, but she made it up right there. Six. Step on the seven. That's good. And there we go. That's our eight. Okay. 
Moving forward. One, two, three, four, five, hold six. And we stop right there, okay? So the key to watch out for right here is this. Okay, so on the one, I am, I am leaning back. I'm looking back on the one, okay? Looking back on the one, even though right now, looking at the mirror, and that's understandable because we're trying to learn it for the first time. You want to get the feedback from the mirror. But we want to look back on the one, lean forward on the two. This is very important on the lean, okay? So leaning forward, you, you see how much, I'm just a little bit lower than, uh, lower, than, lower than Corinne. You want to be low here. So on the next move, three. So the idea is this, I mentioned this in class, we're trying not to move this area, your head, your shoulder, trying to stay in space right there, and your knees coming up, your hips dropping down, I'm going to rewind that just one more time, right here, see? So I'm swinging my arm back, at the same time, hips coming forward, so that's that's the, that's the movement between these, and the head is still uh, staying still. That's four, step on the five, that's the five, and then we hold the six, all right? So let's take a look at that one more time, half time. One, two, three, four. So here's a good example. Let's take a look at uh, Corinne right here. One, two. Notice on the two, okay? Look, look at where her head is. She's pretty high up. On the three, as she rocks forward, her head kind of tilts back a little bit. So there is some movement there. So it's a little bit easier if you tilt forward right on uh, right on that one, two, right on the two. Okay, take a look at me one more time. So one, right on two. See, I really lean forward on the two. Okay, three, four. So I achieve a little bit better isolation right there, even though it's moving still just a little bit, but the idea is trying not to move it at all. Okay, five hold six, all right? So here we go, let's try, let's take a look at that tempo. Five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, okay? Good, moving forward, here we go, let's go slow. Eight, and one, two. So I have to say, this part is probably the trickiest part of, uh, of, of this, uh, this breakdown. What I'm trying to do is take a look at, this will be my right foot. I'm trying to slide it in, okay? As I slide, here we go, let's take a look. Seven, eight, okay? I'm not doing a very, very good job. However, we're trying to keep this foot uh, flat on the floor so it looks like it's more like a glide, okay? One more time, here we go. Right on the seven, watch the seven. Six, seven. Uh, here we go. Seven, seven, and go back on the eight, okay? What I see this is this, in class, a lot of students drop their weight. They kind of step on the seven. My feet is still gliding on the seven, okay? Which means it doesn't really touch the ground. That's what I'm trying to say. Here we go. Seven, this is still in the air. This is still in there. It's not touching. Seven, and then slide back on the eight. And I see Corinne's doing that as well. So I'm sliding forward, seven and eight, okay? So it's supposed to be kind of like an illusion move, sliding forward and back, seven and eight and one. That's my eight and one, and I spin on the two, okay? Here we go, one more time, half time. Seven, eight, and one, two, all right. So that moves kind of hard to do uh, half, half time. Let's try to do it tempo, here we go. One, two, okay, so we held that. All right, moving forward, here we go. One, two, three, and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight, and one, two, okay. So that part is a little bit tricky because of the tempo. We hold, right, we hold five, hold six, then we go seven, eight, and one, two. And, a, and we hold the three, okay? All right, here we go, moving forward. That's two, hold three, and four. Five and six and seven, eight. Okay, so we stopped it right there. Let's do, let's do that part tempo, here we go. And four, 
five and six and seven. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So going back slow, uh, the thing to watch out for, we gotta hold that three. This is slow. One, two, hold three and four. On the end four, it's it's a little bit fast because you're holding the three, so you're waiting. You're holding, you're holding on the on the two, right on the two. Don't do anything on the three, and then you're going and four. Step on and four, okay? And then you, right then you start uh, either toe tapping or sacking. Um, when I first saw this move, uh, I was taught that it was called sacking. So attributed to Sacramento. Five and six and seven, eight, okay? And then we start moving. All right, here we go. Let's break the. Uh, let's let's put the whole thing together from the top. From the top. Here we go. So that is it for this week. If you like it, definitely hit that like button. Share it with those that can benefit from it. And uh, thank you, Corinne. Thank you, Maria, for helping out with this video. And uh, as always, I'll see you next time. Peace.